Thank you, Madam Vice President. This is a joint statement. We welcome Fiji's acceptance of recommendations from Switzerland and Albania to ensure human rights defenders can freely carry out their legitimate activities, including by implementing the Declaration on Human Rights Defenders at the national level. During the previous UPR, Fiji accepted three recommendations related to the protection of defenders, and since the conditions have improved, defenders now operated in a relatively free environment. Nevertheless, there are reports of peaceful protesters being arbitrarily arrested and journalists harassed and intimidated. The rights of freedom of expression and assembly continue to be limited, and more needs to be done to ensure an enabling environment for defenders. We echo recommendations that Fiji repeal all laws and policies that restrict the fundamental rights of freedom of expression, assembly, and association. This includes section of the Public Order Act Amendment Decree, the Media Industry Development Decree, and the 2014 Electoral Decree and the Online Safety Bill. We want to highlight the rights of defenders working for the promotion of and protection of lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, and intersex persons. The Constitution bans discrimination on the basis of sexual orientation, gender identity, or expression. However, as the Rainbow Pride Foundation reported, LGBTI human rights defenders continue to face multiple levels of threats and sexual harassment. We join Argentina and France in recommending that Fiji enhance efforts to combat acts of discrimination and violence against, against LGBTI persons and guarantee that all such acts are investigated and punished. To this end, we urge Fiji to incorporate sexual orientation into anti-discrimination laws and take measures to reduce the targeting and harassment of LGBTI human rights defenders. Thank you, Madam Vice President. Muchas gracias.